Hey guys, before you get into watching this video, I just want to say I refer to it as Let's Play and I've decided to call it Talk and Play, so yeah, just ch change Let's Play to Talk and Play. Also, um, I'm using my headset again just for a bit until I get a proper mic stand for my snowball because I bumped the shit out of it. So yeah, um, just f I don't figure out that you'll notice the difference, I don't really know. Um, enjoy the video, bye. Hey guys, Brenny here, and this is Let's Play Episode 1. Now, before all you guys are thinking, what the hell, he's making another different series of a remake of crap like that. Um, calm your farm, I've got this all worked out, I've got a plan, and I'll explain it to you now. Anyway, I decided that I would like uh, to do a more chill talk about series, like when I just want little subjects to talk about, like for now I want to speak about Christmas and stuff like that. And then I want a thing where I can speak about more serious subjects, people dying, my thoughts on, like, racism or something like that. And that is what the time-lapse talks would be. And I've got to re-actually make a submission thing for that. But I thought I could bring back the Let's Plays as me just doing something on my world while I spoke about a few things on my mind that were little things. Nothing too big and in... Oh, big and... What the... F Nothing too big and like important, but just little things to be be able to talk to you guys because you guys um I get a lot of private messages. I miss it when you're personal, and this is me being personal and stuff. And I'll still have the more personal things like the time lapse talks will be big personal things and my views, and most of the time end up with people hating on me because I have a different view to them. Anyway, but I decided the let's plays could be. Uh, just, yeah, something chill to talk about while I do some work on my world that isn't really worth putting in a build and play. Uh, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoy the idea of that. I did want to start them from scratch again, so if I got some new subscribers, they saw this as my first Let's Play. Anyway, this episode I wanted to actually we'll sum up what everything is first. Alright, so we have our time-lapse talks, which are just real topics, real things in life happening to me, maybe if someone I knew died or something and I wanted to speak about it for some reason I would want to speak about that um, I would speak about it in that because it's deep and a big subject and something important to me this would just uh, and a let's play like this would just be full of little subjects things on my mind um, things I want to speak about things you guys private message me to speak about which I'm fine with if you want me to speak about something feel free to private message me if it's an issue of yours like kind of like Woody's Gamertag does and you want me to speak about it um, give my point of view on it it won't be a good point of view but I'll do it um, anyway since Christmas came uh, well, is coming I figured it'd be a good idea to talk about Christmas and what it means to me and stuff like that and because I was actually I had Crystal over today and uh, I well I didn't invite her I was like oh why don't you come to my uh, family's house for Christmas and she's like oh because I do my own Christmas thing and um yeah so basically I found out talked to her about like what she does for Christmas and she does a whole family thing has family over just her family's not very big like mine and um oh wait mine's big and hers isn't Oh, that sounds weird. Um, anyway, <laughs> well, yeah, she basically does a little family thing, and I never, I never really did that. I did the kind of, I, I visited my family, but it wasn't the fact that I just enjoyed getting presents, really, and that's what Christmas has always been to me, but I think now that I'm older and I don't really care about presents as much, um, I still get a fair bit of cash, though, which is, I'm very thankful for, because I know a lot of people don't get many things at all, and I've always been spoilt on Christmas, um, but yeah, like, I, it's more about, like, the whole family thing going on, so, uh, like, this Christmas I plan on going to my grandma's house where, like, half my family meets up and stuff like that, and I'd like to see my whole family, but it's kind of hard, and then, and then you get those presents that, like, are just little things, and I don't know, I, 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 I'm a person that's hard to say thank you, like, if I, if, honestly feel that they deserve a thank you or give them a thank you but like someone can't give you a present and you don't say thank you so I have to you have to give the thought that counts thank you like if they buy me a top and they oh look at it try it on and I'm like oh it's really ugly <laughs> or something like that um yeah you have to do that fake thank you because you don't want to be like oh this is shit could you take it back and like some of my family will be like oh if you don't like it tell um like your nan or something and she'll um take it back for me just so you like you don't hurt my feelings kind of thing and i like the idea of that but yeah like um 
I hate when you got a present you didn't like. Like, when I was little and I was still learning basically respect, I, I remember I got a present for Christmas and then I went to uh, my stepmom's dad's house and he got me the same present. And I was like, oh, I already got this. And, like, um, I, I just said it really rude and, like, yeah, I just should have came off better than that, really. But I was only young, so I didn't really know. And, yeah, that's, I think, when you learn to lie. And Christmas is, like, the time to lie, which <laughs> sounds really bad. But, yeah, um, that's what Christmas has always been to me. Just, like, presents and just spending time with close people. God damn it, I have this huge fly in my room. It just scared the crap out of me. It nearly hit me in the head. Anyway, um, yeah, like, Christmas has always been, like, presents and just with close family. But now, now I'd like to see people I don't get to see as much and stuff like that because the older you get, the less time you get to contact people, I suppose, because, like, I, I got, you could say this is my job, I suppose. I spend a lot of time doing the YouTube thing, trying to get myself out there, so someday this could be a job, and if I don't have that to fall back on, I suppose I'm going to have to get a real job, which also brings up the subject of, would you guys include this a real job? Like, if I was doing YouTube for enough money to support uh, let's say me and Crystal's living in an apartment and yeah, I could support us just from YouTube. I would consider that a real job because I feel anything that, um, pays you and you do it to, well, not so much to make money. You do it and it pays you so you can provide money for food, rent, bills and stuff like that. I consider that a job, but Crystal doesn't consider that a job. She considers it just a hobby that gives me money, and I don't know, like, I wanted to get your point of view on it and stuff like that, because I know a lot of people have different points of view. I actually found out not long ago that my, um, a teacher I had at school, and I, we just weren't people that got along. I, I learned differently to people, and I think I've explained this in a video, and she didn't really take that into account and kind of didn't really teach me that well, just thought I was giving up, but I wasn't really give up, I just, if you push me, I'm not going to learn, and that's how I learned, and I'm, I swear I've explained it in a video, so I don't want to explain it again, anyway, and yeah, apparently, uh, my friend's little brother goes to that same school now, and apparently she was all like, uh, all regretting like what she said, because uh, I, I actually have gotten somewhere, I'm doing something unique, I'm doing it and making money from it. Like, it may not be enough money to live off right now, and if it doesn't turn out to be, I don't really care, because I had fun doing it, I do, it's not something I'll ever regret. I got to basically point my view out to 30,000 people whenever I wanted to, and I think that's something you really unique, and I know that's not what everyone wants, because I've had people that think they want to do YouTube, and then I speak to them, and they're just like, oh yeah, I'd love to become a partner and make money, and I'm like, yeah, that's not really the right reason to do it. Um, but yeah, like, I'm, I'm just thankful, and like, I, it was funny how she changed her whole opinion of me just over YouTube, which creeps me out, because I don't know how she knows of my YouTube. But anyway, that we're totally off the point, but that's the whole point of this series. I can just speak about whatever I want. Anyway, I wanted to speak about what do you guys want for Christmas? What are you getting? Are you getting something you want? Are you getting something you don't want? Uh, personally, I didn't really... I normally, uh, ever since I hit about... 15, I really just got cash from my family or clothes, and like, if it was clothes, my family knows what I want, if like, they didn't know what I want, they'd give me cash or something, um, but yeah, like, I have a little list of things I normally make, oh, when I was little, I used to, like, like I said, I was spoiled, um, that my family would give me a catalogue and circ say, circle everything you want, and most of the time, I'd get everything, and I know how spoiled that sounds, but yeah, um, I have a pretty big family, so it's, um, like, easy to spread all the presents, I don't really know, um, but yeah, I want to know what you guys are getting, what you guys want, if you're getting what you want, where the hell did my little scythe thing go, what are they called, ho, that's it, I don't know where it is, um, anyway, the things that I kind of have on my list at the moment were a new headset, a uh, new pair of shoes, because my, I, I favorite one pair of shoes, like, I could have, like, ten pairs of shoes, and I'll still go to that one pair, and that pair kind of died, but then I just, well, not died, they went to shit, because they're all dirty and not nice looking anymore, and I, I was going to ask someone in my family just to get me a nice pair of shoes, but the other day I went, um, when I actually got my iPhone, I went and bought a pair of shoes too, 
Uh, so that's kind of off my list now. Also, I, I did want an iPhone, but I bought that for myself too, which I thank you guys for basically because, well, I didn't buy it. I, I hired it. I don't even know what you called. I, I, I got on a plan, so I have to pay monthly so I can use it. Um, which is, I'm really loving it. I really needed a up-to-date phone that I could use the internet on because I am an internet junkie. Like, even reading comments, I'll pop up the phone and bam. Um, but yeah, like, I, I want to thank you guys for giving me the opportunity to be able to pay for li just things in my life. Taking Crystal out, having a phone. If I need a new pair of shoes, I can buy it without, like, saving up or something like that. Um, and stuff like that. I also bought a laptop the other day, which kinda is mainly for you guys. I, I bought it half for Crystal because she, um, oh crap, there's a zombie in here. I didn't know zombies could spawn in here. I bought it half for Crystal because we both want to use the computer at the same time. And we, one of us always ends up on the PlayStation, which is mainly me because I'm nice and let her have the computer. So I decided I would buy a laptop that we could, um, use every, oh, I keep getting efficiency. I want um, efficiency and unbreaking like I got the other one. Uh, anyway, and yeah, I just I could I can split my workload now when I'm uploading. I can um, not so much play because wh while while I was uploading, I always used to play Minecraft or Skyrim. Uh, but when I'm rendering now, or I can actually record more, or I can even just make more progress on things. So I want to thank you guys for that. I hope you guys noticed that I um, have like stepped up my quality in videos uh i was just gonna get another screen but i really needed another device that could take another bit of effort onto it because like i like i'm a multitask i i've always can't just sit there and do one thing i like to be watching a dvd while i do something else while i do something else while i do something else i think it really came to me as a youtuber but yeah um we'll continue on with my list i wanted a mix amp um because I've got Snowball my headset and I plan on getting another headset and stuff like that. So I want to get like a nice good mix amp that can connect all my outputs to one. I believe that's what they're called. I don't really know. But yeah, um, if you guys know the different name of them, please tell me. Anyway, uh, I did want... Uh, I got. I said laptop. I'm looking at a list right now. I wanted a new desk and I still plan on getting one because my desk is covered in crap now. And I actually plan on making a setup video, uh, updated setup video soon. I actually do have old setup videos though on my channel uh, that are really crap with my old phone. But um, yeah, I want to make an up-to-date one and show you guys my new stuff. But I might do that once I get the uh, headset, keyboard and mouse, which I'll get to in a sec. Uh, I wanted a keyboard and mouse. Now, I've been thinking about this for a while because I, I'm very picky. I wanted one that's good for me. And I found a uh, keyboard by Razer. And I know a lot of you guys have different opinions of what shit I should get. But these are the ones I've settled with. It's just a basic keyboard. It looks nice. It's got the buttons positioned how I want. It's got buttons I want extra, like music, pause, play, and stuff like that. Just little things that I um, like to use. And stuff like that. It's also got a USB and a headset jack. Uh, head uh, wait, 3.5 headset jack? I don't know what they're called. But audio jack, that is it. Anyway, and I, I really wanted that because... um. Oh, oh, I thought that was going to be a double one. Anyway, I really wanted that because I'd like to be able to plug it in right in front of me and use my headset instead of having it plugged into my the back of my computer because the headset jack at the front of my computer is actually broken, which in the long run, I do also want to get a new computer, but that's not a big rush on me right now. My computer seems to be doing well, but like it's starting to get to that point where it's a bit out of date and yeah, I need a new one soon. And like I, I, the laptop I bought is in some huge expensive one. I think it cost me $700. It's i5, 6 gigahertz, Windows 7, um... 1 gigahertz RAM, 1 gig RAM? I don't know, whatever. Um, I'm not a computer person, I just showed Potato and he's like, yeah, it's semi-decent for how much you're paying. And yeah, I'm, I also get $600, uh, not $600, $100 return, so it ends out to be $600, which is quite handy for me because $100 is, is the keyboard I want and nearly the mouse. Uh, but yeah, since I got uh, that wanted to get that keyboard, I've been looking at a mouse to get. And I, I saw another YouTuber get a mouse by Razer that I really liked. But it c had like 60 buttons on it. I don't need that. I, maybe one or two just to do little things to add macros for. Um, but yeah, so I, I got a matching... I, well, I'm going to get a matching Razer mouse that I want and stuff like that. But yeah, that's all I really want for Christmas is things like that. 
little things um, mainly to do with the computer because I am a computer nerd. But anyway, I will end the video here because I've crapped on enough about the most random subjects. But I'm I'm really hoping you guys like this subject, uh, this series because I I really do enjoy speaking to you about little things on my mind like this. So yeah, leave a comment of what you want for Christmas, what you're getting for Christmas. If you have a wish list, anything like that, I'd enjoy reading them. You guys might give me some ideas of what I want. Um, leave some feedback if I can improve this series. Um. I will be bringing back time-lapse talks, but like I said, they're for bigger subjects. And yeah, thanks for watching. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. Bye.